Welcome, I am Shani King, I am a data analyst and as the title states below, I will be talking about how I became a data analyst. I've been a data analyst for almost two years now, so I'm fairly new in the data role. However, I do enjoy working with data. In future videos, I will want to talk about what are the challenges of being a data analyst and what are the roles and responsibilities. But for this video, I will all be talking about how I landed my first role as a data analyst. So if you guys are interested, stick around. Let's see. For educational background, I do have a bachelor science degree in computing. You don't have to have a degree to become a data analyst. However, as for me, that's how I did it, or at least that's how I got started in the path of becoming a data analyst. After getting my degree, I decided to quit my part-time job. I was working part-time while I was going to school full-time. However, I wanted to fully focus on building skills in order to land a data position. So the courses or the skills that I tried to build on, the resources was very limited because I had no source of income. So I did Kaggle projects, I did Python courses, I did Tableau courses, Power BI, you name it, anything that was free, I was doing it because I had no source of income, but I was determined and I knew that I wanted to work with data. <laughs> rejection. Rejection on top of rejection on top of rejection. That's what they don't teach us in college. As a newly grad, you're going to get rejected trying to get your first job, but they don't teach you that. It was very demotivated rejections on top of rejections on top of rejections like how do you deal with that how do you be motivated how do you stay motivated how do you give college students assurance that there's a job waiting for them when they finish a four-year course you would think it took me six months in order to get the interview of the job that i'm currently working with right now and Trust me, six months wait time is very short compared to other newly grads wait time. So I'm very fortunate on that side where it only took me six months. For the interview process, it took two to three months in order for me to know if I got the job or not. At the end I did, but I won't say that in the process, I was very nervous, I was very anxious. I was just thinking, why I'm not hearing back from them and is there something that I could have done better but also not to put all my eggs in one basket I was still sending out resumes to other companies still getting rejected <laughs> but you know that's just the process of everything but I did come out successful in the end where I was able to land the position <laughs> so um my thoughts on my process and my path in order to land the first role my first data role is that i didn't do anything that was different or as significant i didn't have a wow factor i was just fortunate enough to get that position and now i'm getting experience working with data but i just tried to build on skills that i already had i tried to learn new skills but that that was about it that was my path in getting my first role so let me know what you guys think. I will be uploading videos about data and what I do in day-to-day -day role. So with that being said, that's it. Until next time, I guess.